How to fix Wi-Fi issues on Mac OS Ventura. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimal from AppGuide. In today's video, I will show you some of the ways on how you can fix Wi-Fi issues on your Mac OS. So make sure to watch this video till the end. Now the very first thing we're going to configure is our Wi-Fi settings. While using your Mac, click on the Wi-Fi icon in the menu bar. Click on Wi-Fi settings, which will launch your system settings. Depending upon which Mac OS version you're using, these settings might look a little bit different. After that, what you can try to do is just simply forget network and then join again. You should see a list of available or previously joined Wi-Fi networks. Select details for the Wi-Fi connection you're having issues with. And if it's not showing up in this list, navigate to your advanced Wi-Fi settings, which will show you a list of all known networks. And make sure that auto join is enabled and proceed to remove the Wi-Fi network from the list of known networks. And alternatively, you can also select forget this network because this will allow you to reconnect to the same Wi-Fi network and can in many cases already fix Wi-Fi connection issues. Issues. The other thing you can try to do is to temporarily disable VPN connection and firewall. In case the problem persists, then navigate to the network section of your Mac settings. Proceed to disable any VPN connection that could be running on your Mac. VPNs can be very valuable, but they can also prevent you from having a stable Wi-Fi connection. Just disable your firewall too for now to see if it's preventing you from connecting to the internet correctly. After that, you can try to disable app limits, content and privacy restrictions and in some cases app limits or content and privacy restrictions can hinder you from using your browser or Wi-Fi connection. So if you're in your settings, navigate to the screen time section. You should first of all make sure that there is no limit to using your browser on your Mac by disabling app limits on your Mac. And under content and privacy, proceed to disable restrictions to see if this helps with your network connection. After that, test and improve overall network connection. If you're able to connect to your router but you should experience a bad network, then open up your browser of your choice and you can go to speedtest.net or fast.com. There are multiple sites available of which I'll also make sure to leave a link on which you can test the internet connection speed. All of these sites allow you to test your average upload and download speed and server latency. Make sure you have a stable download speed and reduce the number of devices using the same network connection. The server you're trying to connect to might be offline for maintenance or other reasons. You should check if you can access the website or service using another device and network connection because this will help you determine if the Wi-Fi issues are related to your network connection or Mac or if it's simply a server related issue. And you can also try to simply run wireless diagnostics if you want to. If the Wi-Fi problem still persists, open a spotlight search and then look up wireless diagnostics. The wireless diagnostics will allow you to test changes and apply some network settings to fix any potential network issues. Click on continue and wait a moment for the diagnostic result. You might be prompted to restart your router and then check the connection process. And last but not the least, simply try to check issues with the internet service provider also known as ISP. Because if nothing helps you out, then make sure that there is currently no problem with your local ISP such as Roadworks which will temporarily disable your network connection. Hope this video cleared the confusion and actually solved your problem. If it did help solve the issue, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you've got any more questions feel free to leave them down thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video